Well, go on, people. I'm here, kind of down the road. It's more Stroud Green than it is Findry Park. But, nevertheless, this Morley's is the first one I've seen in North London. Does it hold up to the weight of, I'd say, the average consensus that the South London Morley's has? Before we get into that, let's get into the crit check, yeah? Boom, bow. On foot today, I've got the Nike Air Max 95 DNA X-ray barefoot anatomy. Little bit of leathers, plastic overlays, but you can see the x-ray. You saw the crap. You saw the foot. Now it's leg day. Let's get into it, yeah? Cool. <laughs> True say these chips are looking extra dry, so mm -hmm. I don't expect anything to kind of stick the chip. It's quite a dense one. Potato content is is stiff. Mm. Very dense, starched off. They're yeah, not crispy though, so they're missing the textures. They're thick, but I can say these are, these are good chips. They're, they're, they're solid, they're pretty hey, solid. These with the juice, you're good. <laughs> very. I have to give these chips a, a, a very... Hey, it's a 4.3, you know. Mm. It's a 4.3. I can respect it. I can respect that. I'm surprised because look, judging by, you know, the texture is an overly crispy. It feels crispy. A hey, points are increasing onto the wings. They're looking chunky still. Very. Hey. Whoa, that wing's looking like the burger. <laughs> Fam, healthy. I do recognize that jacket. Mm -hmm. These man definitely got the same supply as the man down south. You can see a lot of the stray salt and pepper mm -hmm. sitting on it. But you can also see some subcutaneous peppers and seasonings. Ayo, like flavors that. them like that. Like that. <laughs> <laughs> Only thing is, if it had a bit more capsaicin, it'll be doing a bit more. What do you reckon? What do you reckon? What are you saying? You said what? Four, four point five? I, I, I mean, even a four point four. Yeah. There's not enough to it. It just I, I, I hear good. that. It, it's, it's true. It's it true. That's what it, in my head I was thinking. I, I don't know where exactly it sits. A four five, yeah, that's that. Four five. Yeah, so would... after you know much democratic discussion, <laughs> we've agreed a four point five. Yeah. Four point five is fair. Hey, flavors them loud. Textures are on point. The actual chicken quality is blessed. You're not seeing mad anatomy. Clearly, the seasoning and spices are all certified. That was a certified wing. Hey. Yeah, 4.5, 4 definitely. Step into the burger. Fill it. Okay, the fill it busting out the bando. That's a good side. <laughs> this thing is looking seasoned off. It's a bit underwhelming. These flecks ain't doing nothing. Mm, that is hella thick. It is. It's got nothing there. These flecks, I don't know, they could be, they could be some type of chia seeds that are just ground up or, or something out, out. yeah the flavors them are very quiet it's fair to call it very meaty they got everything right but the flavors don't exist 3.7 it's the best it could be without being leng seasonings that's all it comes down to if they had the right seasonings if the capsaicin was talking if we were having a, a, a you know a nice little discourse this would be a whole different conversation and review overall Morley's shop is looking good boss man's a bit cheeky they don't have strips they're waiting on deliveries these are, listen with a name like that you have to stay stocked prices are a hey, listen the game has changed i don't know if you can leave the yard with four pound and be patterned the way you used to be able to definitely not with these man the shop itself looks clean looks pretty fresh it doesn't look like it's been open for any longer than a year I don't know when it actually opened, but it's here now. Everything's looking crisp. It's been pretty cash, so I think I'm gonna give Morley's a, a very steady four. A very steady four. Four. They could do better. I was about to say a bit more, but Bossman don't have strips and he's saying he's waiting on deliveries. Cause come on. So yeah, um four for Morley's. Uh, that is it from here today in Stroud Green. If I had more to say, I would say more. Good day.
usually, listen, a proper boss man, he will allow certain things. I was like, boss, but I changed the beans for a couple weeks. He was like, no, you have to take what's there, beans or coleslaw. Thinking, who is copying beans or coleslaw? Not from the movies, bro. Never that. And that's probably exactly the reason why you can't change it. I don't know why they even stock it. <laughs> why? Now they've got a surplus and they're just trying to yeah, get rid of it. Yeah, it's true. And I, I have a funny feeling they're going to re-up on that surplus. 